what is Wi-Fi, wireless LAN, WLAN, these all terms are interchangeable with each other. So in general terms, Wi-Fi is the network or the signals which we use in home. This is the common perception of a common man, right? So it is a type of network in which devices are connected through air interface. Of course, everybody knows about wireless because everybody is using mobile phones these days. So let's not spend much time on that. But the important point is that most of our network part is still wired like 80% we can say roughly is still wired it's not based on wireless but we see wireless or Wi-Fi everywhere because we are end users so but still our back end our ISPs our switches routers our fiber connectivity everything is through cables either through fibers or either through copper cable so roughly we can say 80% of our network even as of today is still wired right so the official standard for Wi-Fi is 802.11. You might have seen these numbers. What is 802.11? A, B, G, N, A, C. And these days you might be seeing AX, which is Wi-Fi 6. So what are these numbers? I'll also explain in this video series. So this is a series I am starting on wireless or Wi-Fi. I'll make small parts so that it's easily understandable. Right. So here we are discussing what is Wi-Fi. So after Wi-Fi, what is SSID? SSID is the name of your network, of your Wi-Fi network. For example, when you are on your mobile phone and you want to connect to your network, so you turn on your Wi-Fi and then you see so many networks, different names, right? So those names, these names, they are SSIDs, right? So this is also one important point. Another important point is that Wi-Fi communication or wireless communication is usually half duplex, which means there is one way communication at one time as compared to the cable networks, right? But we don't see it uh, as a problem because the speed is so fast that we are okay with even half duplex as well. So typical home Wi-Fi routers, what are these devices? These are a combination like our home Wi-Fi router or our modem router, what we call it, or our TP-Link router or whatever you call it. So this is a combination. It's a hybrid device. It's a combination of a switch, an access point and a small router, all with limited capabilities. So on a typical switch, like it's shown here in the picture, that it usually has a WAN port and some LAN ports. LAN ports are for local connectivity if you want to plug in like a printer or any other device or a server directly into the router. The access point, the wireless part is to connect our mobile devices, our laptops, our tablets and the router is to connect our local home Wi-Fi network to our internet service provider from where we are getting the connection like from Vodafone or from MTN or uh, wherever we are getting. So there are different devices which we can buy on different levels. So in next video, I'll explain about the Wi-Fi standard that what is 802.11, A, B, G, N, A, X, A, C, what is Wi-Fi 5, what is Wi-Fi 6, 6E. So thank you for watching.